guys and welcome. Let's check out the news about Freen and Becky uh, from 99 Top World channel. Why they do that to Freen? Please respect our girl. Hello everyone, welcome to 99 Top World channel. I will tell you about the trending hashtag respect Freen after watching this. Uh, I request you to love Freen and add more. Okay. Uh, subscribe. Okay. Subscribe. Subscribe. It's cool. Uh, in recent days, the Twitter, uh, Twitterverse witnessed a surge in the use of multiple hashtags related to the artist frame. These hashtags became a digital uh, battleground for fans who, exp mm, who expressed their deep-seated concerns about the agency's treatment of freeing. However, the plot thickened just a day ago when all eyes turned to the Idol Factory Twitter account. It underwent a dramatic what? <laughs> it underwent a dramatic transformation as the Yellow Factor agency suddenly emerged as highly active in promoting Becky's solo schedules. The hashtags the Rebecca L'Oreal Lab Tour took center stage in this campaign. Idol Factor's newfound enthusiasm was evident in the plethora of photos and videos they shared with from Becky's live events. The sudden flurry of activity raised eyebrows and piqued curiosity among fans who had grown accustomed to um, the agency's infrequent updates. Many began to speculate whether a new administrator had taken the reins of Idol Factory official account. As fans found themselves divided over Idol Factory sections, two main relatives emerged. On one hand, there were those who felt that the agency behavior towards Fring was uh, undeniably unfair. They pointed out that Idol Factory a second, had never been this uh, proactive in promoting Fring's schedule before. In response, some decided fa uh, dedicated fans initiated the hashtag respect free in. Yeah. Expressing their hopes that Idol Factory would redirect their attention towards Freen's career. On the other hand, a different group of fans dealt into the realm of uh, conjecture. Uh, they theorized that Idol Factory apparent neglect of Freen might be a protective measure. The argument went that Freen had experienced issues in the past. Promoting the Idol Factory to deliberately withhold upper updates about her. This strategy aimed to offer Finn the time and space needed uh, to recuperate from any challenges she may have faced. Furthermore, by refraining from. Huh? She looks here beautifully, by the way. Sharing Finn's content. Idol Factory could be seeking to shield their hair from potential danger. Negative comments on her social media posts. Despite this relative silence, it was clear that Freen continued to work diligently and passionately in her career. Adding the administrator of her devoted fan base in the end, the articles not returned to the future. Fans eagerly anticipated Idol Factory's response to Freen's upcoming schedule, holding out hope for a fair and balanced approach to promoting her events. By encouraging readers to remain vigilant for further updates and to stay engaged in the unfolding drama, it unders uh, underscored the power of social media in amplifying fan voices and uh, unwavering support for their cherished artists. So this is updated news about Freen. Don't leave now. Enjoy the rest of the video. Woohoo! Are we gonna go wild? Yes! Yes! Let's do the shower. Shower part of emotion and shared love towards each other. Coming from Freen and back, of course. Lovely. So catch me if I fall. 
Wait a second. Well, why don't we listen now to the beautiful... Oh, not this one. This one is like as well good, but I meant more like this one. Hours later, still watching this. So, let's go, guys. Have a great day. Stay tuned. Stay awesome. And bye bye for now.